Today on the show, we're going to talk about hidden graphics for your custom arenas that you gotta download. This is some of the best stuff I have seen in 2K23 for arenas and shows. You're not gonna wanna miss it. Plus, stay tuned to the end of the video because we got more secret hidden stuff that you're gonna be able to download for a certain phenomenal superstar. Let's get started. This is coming in from Witty the G. You can search using the hashtag Witty the G or Witty226 as the first hashtag under arenas when you're filtering it. Also go in and favorite those creators too. You hit square, you hit X on your controller, you'll favorite them, and then you don't have to guess where to find all of their stuff. Witty the G has put together 29 custom arena templates for you to use that are giving you all of these secret hidden graphics that are not available in the game. Drives me nuts that we can't get these things the base game we got awesome creators in the community putting this together for us i love the custom arenas from the community and these are incredible it's really cool because some of them have the graphics already built in for transitions and everything in the game when you are making creating arenas so they can go kind of hand in hand but when you search for witty the g you're gonna see so many different arena templates from smackdown raw 2005 raw 2002 SummerSlam 2006 is in there wrestlemania arenas evolution has a template Template with all of the graphics wrestlemania 34 halloween havoc the wwe live event graphics are there so if you want to create a live arena without having to go through my rise to unlock it now you will have the template backlash 2003 is in there shout out to backlash 2003 because i did play around with this before it has all of the transitions and motions in there when you're going to set up the show so you can have them both and you'll have a perfect backlash 2003 and one of my most favorite ones two of them wrestlemania the my rise graphics are in there and we have wcw the my gm templates now this is for the graphics not for the arena templates i'm waiting for somebody to figure this out how we can get the full arenas for my gm and put them in the game we have the graphics you can see on screen here we've got the wcw arena downloaded when you go over to creations under arena we are going to edit the arena you can make a copy of this if you want but you'll be totally good on your own if you just go into the downloaded template once you're in here it's already set up with custom arena so if you don't want to touch anything Thing, you can simply move on to shows and then just produce the WCW with the MyGM graphics. You're all set, but you can go in here and change the venue out and it will work. What's great is that it works in just about everything. You could change the crowd over to WCW to make it a lot more fun. And once again, it will work with any stage design too. If you want to go crazy and you want to modify the entire stage look of it, you can use the preset stage design templates if you like. Or again, you can just go in and you could change the titantrons, side panels, lighting, everything, and you will still have the graphics for WCW My GM. I'm so excited about this. Once you've completed it and you go over to shows, then you have to set up all of the semantics, all the little details to get your show just the way you want. I set up everything so it has WCW, including the arena image is WCW. And you got all the Nitro banners and the look for it. When you are ready and you're all done, you will be able to create a match and select the arena and it will be under your custom arenas and there you will find your wcw the my gm graphics so i really really like this i use the thunderdome just as a quick template to see how it would all look together and i do absolutely love this i was a big fan of my gm mode with the wcw arenas they have in there works when we can't get that arena itself but the graphic templates i really do like and this is awesome add this into your universe mode you're gonna have a lot of fun the same thing goes for wrestlemania arena and this graphics pack is the my rise wrestlemania you can't get it anywhere else it's not in the game drives me insane it makes me so mad i loaded this up played around with it a little bit had a little bit of fun the thing is that you don't want to do with these here's one little warning if you go over to arena templates and you use a different template for it this will remove all of the graphics that's the only thing you don't want to do, as I can show you here, that if I select a template, it's going to override all of the graphics and they're not going to be available. Easy fix of this, just back out of this completely, exit and go back into your edit of your arena with the My Rise template for WrestleMania and it's all back together, it's normal and you could keep editing. And remember, you can change the venue and everything in here. I went in and I changed it over to WrestleMania 31 for the stage design because I thought it went really well with it. And once again, make it your own. I changed all the banners. I love that it has the moving graphics for WrestleMania for the LED going across the side. It looks so good. And I simply like the colors for this My Rise WrestleMania. I like the orange and the blue with a little touch of purple in there. 
it looks awesome when you're ready to go you hit save and then you're going to move over to set up your show and you could set up everything the way you like i put everything together as wrestlemania 38 templates for the show for the graphics transitions and everything and then you're left with this beautiful custom my rise wrestlemania absolutely awesome the ones that i'm going to be checking out next are going to be raw because we got like raw 2002 raw 2005 smackdown is in there too there's a lot to customize here this opens it up for people that want to be able to create arenas and shows a lot more and especially i think for really customizing and updating your universe mode this is a huge win shout out to witty the g for all of this now if you watch night of champions we're not done yet by the way if you watch night of champions we got a brand new world heavyweight champion the first although it's with the lineage of the world heavyweight title so he really the first reason the inaugural the new world heavyweight champion seth freaking rollins came out dominated smashed aj styles who was on smackdown there's a lot of confusing pieces here anyways in 2k23 we have a brand new what is possibly the best looking world heavyweight championship you can download and this is coming over from sleepy guy mike mike has done incredible work here putting together this world heavyweight championship remember in the search make sure that you are under titles for the filter and you put in the first hashtag sleepy guy mike and you will be able to locate this right away mike has three different uploads in there the latest one does say in the description final so this is the final version that he has put together and there's so much detail in here shout out to mike i really really do love this you can see with seth rollins entrance here he's got the world heavyweight championship looks phenomenal he did a great job i love the detail in here if you have a previous world heavyweight championship downloaded or you've used in your universe mode you got to get rid of it i'm saying this because i had to do this make sure that you go and you remove it from your universe mode saves for any custom titles you don't want to use anymore then you can go into the deletion utility and you can delete them there otherwise if you go into deletion utility first it will not allow you because it'll say it's being used in universe mode so make sure you remove it from your existing universe if you're trying to sub out custom titles now if you made it this far i've got one more secret hidden update for you you gotta check out this is going to be a secret hidden AJ Styles title motion is not standard in the game. Let me show you. So this is coming from the creator QWERTYAC. To locate this, it can be a little bit tricky, but what you want to do in the hashtags is the first hashtag put in Call of Duty COD COD. You could follow his hashtags that I've shown on screen here, but I use just Call of Duty COD as the first hashtag and you will see KO star 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 as the download this is a download template that you want to be able to get because what we're going to do is we are going to download this custom creation this has the brand new aj styles title motion and then what you want to do is go over to the creation tab and then under entrance and victory select entrance and then for superstar we are going to copy the entrance motion for this ko star 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 simply copy it copy to superstar copy it over to the in-game aj style you're done you could even at this point if you really wanted to you could delete this custom creation to free up the slot so that you're not overusing too much stuff because everyone gets mad about it and now what you're going to be left with is the secret hidden aj styles title motion and it's awesome now go and give me a side by side here of aj styles for the brand new hidden entrance and that of the standard in-game title motion. You guys can see the difference that we have here. I love the new one because it's the OC and I love the OC's entrance for the DLC. But this one's awesome because you get so much more pyro for AJ for his title as he should, cause he's phenomenal, but it's a way better entrance. You get way more pyro compared to the first one. And it's just a better walk, better motion overall. I can't believe this is hidden in the game. It drives me nuts. Why can't this stuff just be made available? We gotta go through creations and we gotta do all this stuff. But if you guys enjoy this video and you enjoy all the hidden stuff we have here, click right here for more. Subscribe to the channel, hit the like button. I will see you on the next one. Bye.